Hey guys, what's up? I want to show you what's going on over here today. We got a, uh, this was an SSD recovery. This SSD right here, or actually, let me go back. Let me show you this right here. This is uh, the SSDs that the Macs are using. MacBook Pro Airs. They're proprietary. This uh, connection here is proprietary. It's not something just generic. Uh, and as, as far as uh, the different uh, proprietary connections, I've, I've identified three. So this customer came in with this drive and she needed a recovery for it. So I said, sure, we got Macs here in the house. The easiest way to do it is to actually just grab a Mac and, and put it on there. And we had three different ones. We had a, a MacBook Air. Well, we had a couple of MacBook Pros here. I have my uh, MacBook Air as well. So the first two... We just didn't, uh, you know, didn't work. We finally got this. this. is a MacBook Pro late model, and this one does have the same connector. And this is the the customer's drive right there. So this is the easiest way to do it. There's some external adapters, and we actually had an external adapter, did not work. They're very tricky. Uh, and basically, bottom line, if you're gonna do this, you just want to find yourself a Mac that's compatible. Unfortunately, in this case, it did not boot. So what you want to do in, in that case, if it does not boot, you want to have yourself an external drive with an operating system on it, like we have here. And I know some of these videos that I do, I show a lot of uh, you know, software and tools, but if you don't have these things, you just can't do it. So we connected it here, we boot it up to this OS, to this OS and then we go to, uh, to the disk utility, uh, and it's not there. So okay thank you so it's not there the only hard drive that's present is the external one so unfortunately in this case this SSD looks like it's kind of dead or actually dead there it is so just a little couple of tips on these hard drives also if you're gonna do an upgrade you have to make sure you got the right version you just can't buy a you know Mac Pro Mac Air uh, SSD drive. You got to make sure you get the right one. Look up, uh, go with your serial number online, and uh, I'll put a link uh, on this on this page at the bottom of the page for you, where you go with your serial number to give you all the specs uh, of the of your Mac, so you're able to uh, order whether it be an SSD or or any other part. They are pretty tricky. So that's what's going on here today at PC911.